an exodus of cows heading towards Lesotho and South African border in Matatiele, stolen from the emerging subsistence farmers, while some taken from crawls at gunpoint. Horses are being used to drive the head through the gorges, mountains, bushes and rivers. Stock theft has a negative economic impact to the villagers of Matatiele that are solely dependent on livestock for their livelihood. <laughs> I have nothing. They took all my livestock. Now I have just come to check if my cows are not here by any chance. I reported the matter to the police. And I suspect that one there is mine, but I will confirm with the officials. Residents believe these dog thieves are groomed at a tender age. They drop out of school and focus on stealing livestock. These young boys are allegedly taught tricks of defending themselves in the mountains. This young man says he started this job at the age of 14. I was caught in the mountains of Mafupi by the forum and I was looking after the flock of sheep. Some of the sheep were locked in the forest kraal. This is what I have been doing since I was very young. Zuko Nwema, an emerging farmer, lost 54 cows. They were all taken from his farm in 2019. 2019, uh, about 54. In 2019, they took 54 cows. So today I'm here to identify my cows. I have managed to identify 32, but they are still not enough. 22 more cows are not here, but I will keep on looking around because I lost everything. Matatiele Operation Tudula is working with law enforcement agencies, including members of the South African National Defense Force and police. The aim is to curb stock theft. Yes, we are trying to use horses to fight this dog theft, but we think that a chopper would be ideal because it will be able to move up and down the mountains, tracking the stolen livestock. We are asking our government to please help us with a chopper because there are many cattle that are still in the mountains. Some are stolen from Lesotho crossing to South Africa and others are stolen from South Africa to Lesotho. Police in the Eastern Cape say they are strong stock theft crime prevention mechanism to deal with cross-border stock theft. Every week there is a large number of, number of uh, livestock uh, that is being recovered by the stock theft units in concert with the farming communities. Very soon we shall be outlining our bigger plan uh, which will, of course, demonstrate our commitment and determination in ensuring an end to the rampant stock theft in our province. Farmers are calling on law enforcement agencies to not only focus on border entrances. They feel that the borderless barrier between Lesotho and South Africa causes huge problems in controlling criminal activities. They say stock theft is affecting rural development and growth. Kulule News, Matatiele.